Welcome back everybody to the 13th episode of my AC Milan career mode and we are finally in April and then there's May and then the season is going to end. Today we are going to have this game in the Champions League, the second leg of the quarterfinal against Bayer Leverkusen. If we pick up a victory we are going on through to the semi-finals. Then we're going to have the game against Palermo, I'm going to simulate this home game against Perugia. We're going to play one leg in the Champions League uh, semi-final and then I will be playing this game away at home against Fiorentina. Maybe I might even simulate Simulate this home game against Atalanta. We'll have to see where I am at the end of this video. Starting 11 for this match, De Gea, Fabinho, Varane, Romagnoli, Semedo is playing at left back because all of our left backs are either tired or, you, you know, they're just tired. Vito, Verratti, Kalanoglu, El Sharawi at right wing, Pato, and Neymar. The first leg of this game was a 3 1 victory for us. Hopefully, we can replicate what we did last time. It was a very good showing from this Milan side. But I think they're going to come out here. They're going to be on ultra attacking for most of the game. So we need to watch out. And we at least need to pick up two or three goals. To just secure that victory and that place into the semifinals. Very nice steal. Kalanoglu to steal off the young Witzel. Come on. Verratti's running. Okay. I'll shut out. You know what? Go. Take it yourself. Let's go, Stefan El Shadawi. Send in an early cross. There's Pato. Pato with the header. It goes to Neymar. Neymar on the volley. Oh, my goodness. Neymar with a beautiful strike on the volley. It is 4-1 on aggregate. The ball was swung in by El Sharawi to Pato. Pato could not get to the header. And then the ball lands to Neymar. And Neymar, first time volley into the near post, into the back of the net. Neymar's fourth goal in the Champions League. 29th minute, we're up 1-0. Very nice, Neymar. Let's have a finish off from outside the box and hits off the post. Neymar was so close to putting in a second, but the post denied him. Come on, get there, Fabinho. But it's going to go out for a throw-in. And Neymar's going to get a yellow card for some reason. I think there was a challenge before that shouldn't have been a yellow card, but Neymar goes into the books with a yellow card. Neymar, Pato, let's go, let's go, Pato. See if we can put one in before the half ends. But the referee is going to blow for halftime. 1-0, a nice strike from Neymar. Put us up 1-0 in the 29th minute. We are up 4-1 on aggregate. Stefan El Shadawi, cut inside. Very nice, El Shadawi. Very nice to Pato. That's a very nice ball. Come on, Pato. Pato, can he put this into the back of the net? Alex Pato off an assist from Stefan El Shadawi in the 63rd minute. Puts it into the back of the net. This is pretty much shielded deal. We are in this we are into the semifinals. Very nice pass from Stefan El Shadawi. Even nicer finish from Pato. First goal in the Champions League, 64th minute. It's 2-0 and 5-1 on aggregate. Pato stole the ball off of the defender. Let's go, Pato. Run around the defender. Very nice dribbling from Pato. Avoid the sliding challenge. El Shadawi, get out of my way. Pato still on the ball. Pato gets taken down. And there's no foul. Referee, how is there no penalty over there? Pato, I just wanted to, like, walk it inside the net. I wanted to score a decent goal with Pato. But he freaking got taken off the ball. There was no penalty. It looked like it might have been a penalty. I think that's going to be the end of the game. Referee, blow the whistle. Freaking blow us on through to the semifinals. Very nice. Yes. A goal from Neymar and a goal from Pato puts us into the semifinals. 5-1 on aggregate. Very good performance. And let's see who we get matched up against. Take a look at some of the other games. Wolfsburg and Dortmund finished 4-4. So that probably ended in extra time or penalties. Uh, Arsenal beating Bayern Munich 3-2 on aggregate. Man City 2-1 over United on aggregate. And us 5-1 on aggregate against Leverkusen. Even though we've moved on to the semi-finals, we cannot forget about the Serie A. We have an away game coming up against Palermo. So for this match, I'm going with a very rotated lineup because most of my players were dead tired from last game. I'm going with Gabriel Semedo, Eli Ridwald, Vendel Salah, Mauri, Mastali, Bonaventura, the Zlatan Ibrahimovic regen playing his first game, and Paulo Dybala. I don't know what to expect going into this game against Palermo. I did not see them on the top seven of the table, but they do have Franco Vasquez. They do have Simone Verdi, who I sold to them. Hopefully, he doesn't come back and bite me in the ass, and then he scores against his former club. I think we could pick up three points in this game. Uh, honestly, it looks... Uh, it looks it looks quite easy, to be very honest. That's a nice pass into Jack Bonaventura. Bonaventura, let's cross this. But it's blocked by Gonzalez, and we do have a corner coming up in the fifth minute. Let's see if we can score off this corner. Mauri to Mastali. Mastali, I think he's playing his, fir like his first game that I'm actually playing with him. Ridwald with a shot. And a very nice save from Alisson, the Brazilian keeper. We have another corner coming up. Let's send this into Mauri and let's cross this in. Who's in the middle? Who's there? But a very nice header from the Palermo defender. Vendel Mastali. 
Nastali to Bonaventura. Let's go, Giacomo. Let's go, Giacomo to Paulo Dybala. Come on, Dybala. Against his once former club, Dybala. Into this. Yes, Dybala. Very nice. Dybala. Let's go. Far post, Dybala. What are you doing, Paulo Dybala? Don't. Oh, my God. Come on, Mauri. Very nice, Mauri. Jose Mauri. Jose Mauri to Zlatan. Let's go, Zlatan. Come on, Zlatan. Come on, Zlatan. Get this. Come on, Ibrahimovic. Ibrahimovic. No, Alisson with the save. Dybala's there. No. Alisson made the save on Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Couldn't put in his first goal in his first game. Decent effort, though. And I think that's going to be the end of the half. Just get the ball off Djurjevic to Verdi. Very, okay, very nice tackle from Vendel. But that's how the half is going to end. Nil-nil. Decent effort from us. We just need to bury our chances. Watch a shot. Watch a shot, Ridwald. No, Ridwald. Eli, very nice challenge from Rodrigo. Eli could have been a penalty, but he timed it just right. Come on. We need to... No, Salah, what are you doing? Do not lose the ball like that, Mohamed Salah. Are you guys seriously passing around the back? And then you're going to come here and cross this in. Get this out. Come on, let's go. Oh, my God. I'm not going to pick up a victory over here. I'm not going to pick up a victory over here. Nothing was going in. Alisson saved that shot on Zlatan. And nobody else can put the ball into the back of the net. And we pick up one point here away from home. We're sitting at 72 points. Hopefully this doesn't hurt us in the table. But we do have a home game against Perugia coming up. And I'm confident that we can pick up three points in that match. Home game coming up against 20th place Perugia. They currently sit with 18 points. And we are first place with 33 games played and 72 points. Let's go in this match. We are going with the 4-4-2 formation with Gabriel Calabria, Ridwald Laporte, Vendel Mastur, Mauri Tillemans, Bonaventura, and Bolo Dybala. Let's simulate all the way to the end. And we pick up a 1-0 victory off a goal from Giacomo Bonaventura. So here is who we have been matched up against. Arsenal are the team that I'm playing against. And you guys all know that I really like Arsenal as a team. So in the semifinals, we need to beat Arsenal to move on through to the Champions League final. So let's jump into this match. Hopefully this away leg, we can pick up two to three goals and set us up very nicely for the home leg. Starting 11 is De Gea, Fabinho, Varane, Romagnoli, Vendel, Vizzo, Verratti, Tielemann, Salah, Pato, and El Shirawi. You might be wondering where his name are. Since he picked up that yellow card, he, he's not available for this game because he does have a red card. So let's jump into this match. Arsenal are going with Petr Cech, Debushi, Gabriel, Koscielny, Monreal, Pjanic, Ramsey, Walcott, Keita, Ozil, and Giroud. They still have Giroud at striker. I'm surprised they haven't picked up a new striker. That's honestly the position I would choose right away to pick up a striker if I was doing uh, an Arsenal career. Us, obviously, you saw my lineup. So let's kick this match off. We're wearing our green kits. Hopefully, we can walk out of here with a victory for the return leg at home. Ramsey into the middle. Oh, my goodness. Walcott starts them off with a goal in the fourth minute. They were just passing. Like, like look at his passing. They give it to Ramsey. Ramsey, I don't know why Semedo started running forward. Semedo tries to make a challenge. Walcott puts it into the back of the net. It's 1-0 in the fifth minute by Tio Walcott. What's the cross? What's the cross, Romagnoli? Very nice, Romagnoli. But he still sends in the cross. Vendel, El Shadawi, get this out. Let's go, Pato. Come on, Pato. Let's go. Let's see if we can put one in before the halftime ends. Pato to Salah. Come on, Salah. Come on, Salah. Salah and Pato, you got speed. Salah, cut inside. No, my goodness. Why do I keep using that fucking skill move? It was all my fault. It's one nothing for Arsenal. A goal from... I don't even know who. I really don't care. But we need to pick up a goal in the second half. I have freaking three shots on target. They have four shots on target. Like, come on. Very nice. Pato. Tielemans. Tielemans. Let's go to Vitzel. Come on, Vitzel. Come on, Vitzel. Take this yourself. Vitzel to Tielemans. Tielemans into the back of the net. Yuri Tielemans. What a strike. What a pass from Axel Vitzel and Yuri Tielemans. We finally break through this Arsenal defense. Very nice. I guess you can call it a 1-2 because it was Tielemans to Vitzel. Vitzel back to Tielemans. And Tielemans, a first-time shot into the back of the net. First goal in the Champions League. 52nd minute. It's tied 1-1. Pato. Tielemans. Tielemans, let's go, Tielemans, Tielemans, to uh, the freaking Witzel, I forgot his name, come on, Pato, have a shot, Pato, Pato, into the back of the net, it is 2-1, finally something's going right in this game, very nice passing play from everyone, and Pato with the final ball into the back of the net, that's Witzel's second assist, very nice from Tielemans, Tielemans to Witzel, I freaking couldn't even remember his name for the life of me, and Pato puts it into the back of the net, his second goal of the Champions League in the 63rd minute. We are up 2-1. 
Watch it, Walcott is very quick. Do not make Walcott cut in or cross it. Laporte tries to make a challenge. That was terrible by me. Walcott on the ball. Oh my goodness, thank God. Oh, fuck off. Terrible defending by me. Terrible fucking defending by me. What is wrong with my defending? And Walcott puts it into the back of the net. Theo Walcott, I don't even want to watch the replay. That was terrible by me. And it's 2-2. Two -two. Go Salah. Let's go Salah. Nice. Nice. Let's go Pato. Come on Pato. I think you're onside. I think you're onside. Let's go Pato. Pato. Near post. Pato. No. No. Pato. You needed to score over there Pato. That's to Caballero. I don't even know who Caballero is. And to Wilshire. That's the end of the game. 2-2 on aggregate. Terrible fucking defending by me. Led to two Arsenal goals. But it's 2-2. It could be worse. Uh, I just need... Arsenal cannot score any goals at home. And we need to score at least two to three goals. Because or else we are not moving on. Th we weren't. We are not moving on through to the finals. Because Arsenal is such a very good team. And walk out with two fucking goals. This guy is so quick and he's so good. Now usually I wouldn't be simulating away games, but because we have the game against Arsenal coming up in uh, in in two days from this game, I really want to play the second leg of the Arsenal game. See if I get into the Champions League final. So I'm going to be simulating this match against 7th place Fiorentina. Gabriel, Calabria, Ridwald, Laporte, Romagnoli, Mastur, Mauri, Tielemans, Bonaventura, Mbolo and Dybala simulate all the way to the end. A goal from Tielemans and a goal from Mbolo puts us up 2-1 and we pick up a 2-1 victory and we pick up 3 points which puts us at 78 points. Very big game coming up here at home at the San Siro against Arsenal. We need to pick up a victory by any means. Doesn't matter by freaking I need two goals, three goal victory because the aggregate is 2-2. Starting 11, De Gea, Semedo, Varane, Romagnoli, Vendel, Vitzel, Verazzi, Kalanoglu, Salah, Pato and Neymar. Doesn't matter that we're at the San Siro. It does not matter because we are in front of our home fans. Arsenal was a very good team last game. So let's see if we can freaking pick up a victory over here. That's a very nice steal from Pato. But Salah loses the ball once again. Neymar. Vitzel. Vitzel hold this. Vitzel has Kalanoglu breaking forward. Kalanoglu have a shot. It's blocked once again by an Arsenal defender. And we have another corner coming up. Let's send this in, Neymar. Let's send this in. Neymar into the middle. There's Varane. Varane goes for the header, but Petr Cech is there. Come on, Verratti. Very nice. Let's go. Neymar, Vitzo, Verratti. Come on, Verratti. Verratti loses the ball so easily, but he picks it back up to Neymar. Neymar to Pato. Pato back to Neymar. Come on, Neymar. Neymar to Vitzo. Vitzo back to Neymar. I have nothing. I'm in the corner. Neymar, take it. Come on, Neymar. Use that dribbling. Come on, Neymar. Neymar. Fucking has nothing. Neymar to Verratti. Verratti, turn and shoot. Verratti, shoot. Verratti. Goes wide. Verratti. Come on. You need to keep that shot low over there. The referee is going to blow for halftime. Nil, nil. I had some decent efforts. I just need to put the ball into the back of the net. So Semedo. Over the top for Pato. Come on, Pato. Very nice, Pato. Come on, Pato. Go. Cut inside. Nice, Pato. Pato on the ball. Pato gets taken down, but nothing happens. Neymar gets taken down. And finally, we're getting a penalty. We are getting some luck. Debushi. Takes down Neymar, and Neymar is going to have a penalty coming up. I know they put Pato, but I am putting Neymar. Come on, Neymar. Let's go, Neymar. Top right corner, Neymar. Top right corner, Neymar. Neymar. Yes. It is 3-2 on aggregate. A goal from Neymar. Very nice penalty from Neymar. Debushi, a terrible sliding challenge. And Neymar puts that into the back of the net. It's 3-2 on aggregate, but the game is not done here. Arsenal are gonna come at me with everything they got, so I really need to defend well. Hopefully, I could put another one into the back of the net. Demedo, Pato, come on, Pato, Pato to Salah, Salah, yes, he's on side. Come on, Salah, cut inside, very nice, Salah to Pato, Pato, let's go, yes, Alexandre Pato into the back of the net. And why is he shushing? Why is he shushing? <laughs> Pato was shushing the Arsenal fans. Very nice from Salah. And Pato on the freaking counterattack. And Pato into the back of the net when he really needs it the most. Third goal of the Champions League. 81st minute. I'm going on park the bus. I need to secure myself a spot into the Champions League final. In the middle, Laporte. Very nice. Get that out. Ramsey on the ball. Ramsey being shadowed. Well, not really shadowed by Pato. He's just going to have to take it around into the middle to Walcott. Okay, they try to send it into Pjanic. Pjanic is playing it backwards for some reason. And yes, we are going on through to the Champions League finals. A 2-0 victory. A penalty goal from Neymar. And a goal from Alex Pato. Okay, if you look on the other side of the other semifinals. Dortmund won 2-1 on aggregate. 
over Manchester City. So we are going to be facing Borussia Dortmund in the Champions League final. That is going to be a very exciting match. So this final match of the episode against Atalanta, it is at the San Siro and I am going to be simulating it just so we can progress further. And after this match, there's going to be two more games left in the Serie A and one game in the Champions League. I'm going with Gabriel Calabria, Ridwal Laporte, Vendel Mastur, Mauri Tillens, Bonaventura, Mbolo and Dybala. Dybala scoring in the 13th minute. Simulate all the way to the end. A goal from Tielemans, a goal from Mbolo and two goals from Paulo Dybala. So that is the end of this episode. If you guys have enjoyed it, as you can see right there, we are sitting with 81 points with two games left. Juve have three games left and they cannot catch up to us. So basically, we have won the Serie A. I'm going to be playing the final game just to show you, you know, the ceremony and all that. And in the next episode, we are going to have the Champions League final. So if you guys have enjoyed this episode, you can leave me a like down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Do it! Do what? Just do it! Okay, do what? Do it! Subscribe to our channel! Whoa, calm down there, Shia. Just do it! Also, follow us on Twitter at TheNobsYT. Just do it!